with Hashem's help. I'm going to be in the operating room tomorrow for major surgery, something I never faced before in my life. There's one thought on my mind that I hope will help me have the strength to climb this hill in my life. And that is, the Pesuk says, Amzu yasati li teladi saferu. Hashem created us so we should thank Him. Recommended to say berachot, 100 berachot a day. Thank you, Hashem, 100 times. And it's not so much that he needs our berachot, but that we need to feel thankful and blessed. It is not the happy who are thankful. It is the thankful who are happy. And I know when I go into that room tomorrow, no visitors are allowed in the hospital. But I will not be there alone, of course. Hashem's presence is with every sick person. But I know I'll be there with your tefillot, with your prayers, with your good wishes. My name is Yitzhak Mordechai, Meroz Zizha. You've been praying for me. Continue to. On Shabbat Gadol, my heart stopped and the doctors gave up on me. And Baruch Hashem, Baruch Hashem. I was saved, my kidneys failed, and I've been on dialysis for six and a half months, five hours a day, four hours a day, five days a week. Be'ezat Hashem, tomorrow I will have this operation and some very courageous and very giving person is gonna give me a kidney. How lucky we are that we have such people and how lucky we are that we have renewal. A.J. Gindi, Moshe Gewurz, Chaim Steinmetz. They get other people to give. They've given themselves. We're not talking about people giving a financial donation, they're giving, but they're not Vesavadam, flesh and blood. When they put out the notice, 500 people offered to you. How lucky we are, how fortunate we are. It says, Ve'yeshev Yaakov. Ve'yeshev, I heard from the great Hacham Radio Yosef. Ve'yeshev is all the problems that Yaakov had. Vav is the second letter of Yosef. And Yud is the second letter of Dina, and Sin is the second letter of Isab, and Bet is the second letter of Laban. All the problems he had. But I question why second? <coughs> why not the first letter? Because before you talk about your problems, before you manage with your problems, say thank you for the good. That's why Yaakov Avinu insid, insisted that Ephraim should go before Menashe. Ephraim is, thank you for helping me multiply. And Menashe is, I forgot my problems. Before you talk about your problems, talk about your blessings. We have so many of them. A head without a headache is already dead and found in a grave. One could concentrate on the headache or he can count, concentrate on all the other wonderful things. Tell a story about a lady who was on the beach with her little child, dressed in a beautiful navy uniform with a nice cap, and a wave came and took away the baby. And the mother's crying and yelling and davening and pleading, please, I need my baby. And miraculously, a wave comes and brings him back. And she looks up to Hashem, thank you. Thank you for saving my baby's life. But where is the cap? Where is the cap? We don't say where is the cap. We say thank you. We appreciate Hanukkah's days of Lehalel or Lehudot to be appreciative, to say thank you. I thank you for being so supportive. I need more help. I need more support. 
And the greatest thing Hashem can do for us is not only to do good for us, because good is a pleasure for Him to do, but when He does bad for us, when He hurts us, it hurts Him more than it hurts us. We're His children. But He does it for our good. The Gemara says, nobody, since Hashem created the world, no one thanked Hashem until they asked him and thanked him. Gemara Berachot, Zayin Amabet. What does it mean? Abraham didn't thank Hashem. Yitzhak didn't thank Hashem. Until they asked him. They all thanked Hashem for the good, but they thanked Hashem for all the pain, for all the tears. So much tears that her eyelids fell off because she thought she was going to marry herself. And she looked back when she had a fourth son, Yehuda. She said, now I say thank you. Not thank you only for the baby, but thank you for the tears. But look what can, what happened because of the tears. I got married to Yaakov. I had six children from him. I'm going to be buried next to him. My sister had only two children. And she's going to be buried on the road. The Kohen Gadol comes from me. The Melech comes from me. Thank you for the pain. One has to take every pain. Every pain, every knock is a boost to grow from it. Be'ezat Hashem, all those who are waiting for a kidney, hold on, hold on, Hashem is with you. Renewal is there, and you should be renewed. Hadesh, amenu, kekedem, Be'ezat Hashem, in every good way, amen.